Hello students, welcome to your computer class. Today we'll be doing a lesson number 2, hardware and software. And the topic we are going to cover is computer hardware, input devices, output devices and software and its types. As we know, computer is an amazing machine that can do different types of jobs. It has a different parts that work together to form a computer system. Therefore, the two basic parts of a computer system are hardware and software. Hardware The physical parts of a computer that you cannot touch and see are called hardware. Example, mouse, CPU, monitor, keyboard, printer, etc. These devices are attached to the CPU by the means of cable. Some parts of the hardware lie outside the computer system, therefore, other parts of the hardware are inside the CPU box. Example, hard disk, CPU chip, motherboard, etc. Hardware of a computer is further classified into three parts, input, output and storage devices. Now we will study about all the three parts in detail. Number 1. Input Devices These are special type of hardware devices that are used to input words, numbers, sounds, pictures into a computer system. Example, keyboard, mouse, joystick, microphone, etc. They are known as input devices. Functions of some of the input devices are Number 1. Microphone. A microphone is used to record a voice and other sounds into the computer. Number 2. Joystick. It is used for playing games. It helps to move the items on the screen. Number 3. Scanner. A scanner copies a picture or text printed on a paper onto the computer. Number 4. Web camera. It is used to share the pictures and have live chat with our friends and relatives using internet. Light pen. It looks like a pen that can be used on a special pad. Whatever you write on this can be seen on the monitor. What are output devices? The devices which displays the information and results are called output devices. Example, monitor printer, speaker, etc. The function of these devices are as follows. Monitor. It looks like a TV screen. Whatever you type on a keyboard can be seen on the monitor. It also displays the processed information. Printer. It prints the output that you see on the computer system on paper. Speaker. Speakers are used to hear music, sounds, stored in a computer. Storage Devices The devices which are used for storing data are called storage devices. Hard disk is the main storage device which stores the entire work we do on a computer. Some of the storage devices are CD, pen drive, DVD, etc. which are used to store information. CD CD stands for Compact Disc. It is a round, flat and shiny disc that stores a lot of information. Hard Disk It is fixed inside the CPU box. It is a device which stores a huge amount of information and data into the computer. Pen Drive It is a very small device that can be used to store data and also transferring the data from one computer to another. It is also known as flash drive. Now we will study about the second basic part of a computer system that is software. Now what is a software? Software is that part of a computer which cannot be seen and touched. To make the hardware work, we need to have software in it. Let's take an example. All of you must have seen and used a music system. The parts like speakers, CD, DVD, which you can touch and see, are called hardware. Can you see the songs or music recorded on a CD or a DVD? 
No, because it is a software. A CD is a hardware, but the songs or movies which are stored in it are software, as they cannot be seen and touched. Therefore, the two types of software are system software and application software. System software. It is a set of programs that controls the overall working of a computer. Operating system is a part of system software that makes the computer run. It manages all the input and output devices. That means the number of input devices or the output devices which are attached to a computer system and also controls its working. Therefore, without an operating system, a computer is unable to work because it manages the working of a computer. Application software. The software that helps you to do the specific type of a work is called application software. Using application software, we can do a particular job. For example, MS Paint. It is used for drawing pictures. Games. It is only used for entertainment. Calculator. It is only used for doing calculations. Wordpad. It is used for typing and making corrections in the text. Hence, a particular work can be done using these kinds of software. With this, we conclude our chapter number 2 of computer. Thank you.